Hey guys, and welcome back. We are on the last, 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 last segment of Law of Attraction. Law of Reaction gets at the idea that you ought to treat your body as a temple. Treat yourself with the utmost high respect, dignity that you would want other people to give to you. You have to give it to yourself first. You should always remember to act in a way that is honorable to you as well as others. Now with that being said, pretty much gets back to the law of magnetism in that if you think positive, you'll feel positive. If you think happy, you'll be happy. And basically it is the sum of all of the laws kind of placed into one. What I found over time is that basically me becoming this all around good person, all my actions are aligned, you know, operating in a harmonious balance, understanding the ups and downs of life. I have essentially understood that once you become this good happy positive person it's really hard to see like the negatives and things or the ugliness and things because you don't really have those values within yourself so basically in a situation you might have this terrible challenge that comes up to you you may have strong feelings of anger or sadness with certain situations but over time what I found is that since I've become this positive person is this happier person I will understand that feeling I will watch it pass and I'll kind of be like okay what's the lesson I've acknowledged this feeling that I've received you know whether it's anger sadness resentment hurt you know whatever the case might be now let's get to the bottom of it what's my lesson what will I learn what will I take you know for with me in in the next part of my life because we can't sit here and harp on this one thing forever basically y'all have y'all ever heard somebody say do the right thing like it could be any situation do the right thing is almost like a universal quote that a lot of people should understand as to if you're faced with a challenge or a situation it is always best at the end of the day to do the right thing and i know that's easier said than done but a lot of times we just have to remember that you know we ought to do what's right for ourselves as well as other people and i know that's a little little bit hard to think about essentially going forward I have always put myself in the mind frame of treat others how I want to be treated so if I want to be treated with respect then I ought to give others respect I think a great takeaway from this law specifically is you will reap what you sow so if you are continuously upset with others if you're angry towards others if you're mean then it's all gonna come back to you and, and one could say basically karma I hope that this series has taught you guys some things I hope you got some great takeaways please be sure to tell a friend to tell a friend be sure to check out the podcast that I was recently featured in being brown I have placed this on on my Instagram be sure to follow me on Twitter where I post random things from the heart honestly y'all like it be me in like a certain situation I'd be like oh my god I would like to tweet this so I tweet it so be sure to follow me on there and as always thank you so much for watching I will see you guys next time on my next video be sure to comment anything that y'all might want to see you can DM me on Instagram you can tweet me about it but I'm always open to hearing what you guys want to see or even just trying to you know get some new topics mental health topics things to discuss because that's what i like to do i like to talk <laughs> but i will see you guys next time thank you so much and please don't forget to subscribe bye